Hi guys, HT Movies here. Today, I will show you a horror movie from 2009, titled The Human Centipede. Before we start, it is recommended that you do not watch this video while eating. The movie begins by showing a doctor named Hyder, who is observing a strange photo in the photo there are three dogs connected into one piece. Shortly after, came a truck that stopped right behind Hyder's car. The truck driver then got out and headed into the bushes to defecate, but unexpectedly Hyder got out of the car with a gun and immediately shot the truck driver. The scene then turns to two beautiful women named Lindsay and Jenny, they are both from America and are currently enjoying a vacation in Germany. At night they plan to go to a nightclub, but Lindsay and Jenny who do not really know the direction of the road make them lost in the area around the forest. Unfortunately, when they want to return to the highway suddenly their car has a broken tire. They tried to call for help through emergency calls, but their presence around the forest certainly made it difficult for them to get a signal. Confused to seek help, they finally decided to wait in the car. Soon they were approached by a car. It turns out that this man is a perverted man who wants to invite them to make love. Aware of the man's perverted behavior they ignored him, finally this man left Lindsay and Jenny. Since no help came, the two of them finally tried to trace the road to find the nearest help on foot. We came from over here, I swear. Being there for hours, Jenny. Yeah, we could have waited and it would have been... After a long walk, Lindsay and Jenny finally found a house in the middle of the forest. When the owner of the house came out, it turned out that the owner of the house was Dr. Hyder. Hyder kindly allowed them to enter his house. Lindsay explained everything and asked Hyder to call the emergency services. However, Hyder here is just pretending to call while making a drink for Lindsay and Jenny which turns out that the drink has been mixed with sleeping pills. When given drinks Lindsay and Jenny were not suspicious at all. Lindsay accidentally dropped her drink but suddenly Hyder got angry while saying a rant. It scared them so much that they decided to leave immediately, but the sleeping pills they had been taking began to react to Jenny. Hyder then came with a towel, he honestly said that Lindsay and Jenny had been given sleeping pills. The next day, Lindsay and Jenny wake up and are already in the basement of Hyder's house. They are helplessly bound with one man who is none other than the truck driver who was previously shot by Hyder. Hyder then came up to the man and said that he didn't fit in. Hyder then injects liquid to kill him, the incident makes Lindsay and Jenny can only scream in fear. It didn't take long, Hyder again managed to get a new victim. He is a Japanese man named Katsuro. Then Hyder displayed a projector in front of them. Hyder explained that he was an expert surgeon when it came to separating conjoined twins. However, there was one crazy dream of him to create a new creature. Hyder once experimented on three of his pet dogs and now he wants to do those experiments on humans. Hyder explained in detail how he would stitch his three victims into one by connecting the mouth to the anus so they could share one digestive system. Salated grafts to the, the human centipede. <laughs> During the anesthetic process, Lindsay tried to untie and tried to escape, but the infusion hose that was still attached made her hand bleed. Lindsay ran and hid in one of the rooms. Lindsay continued to run until she finally fell in the pool. Her behavior made Hyder become so angry that Hyder threatened that Lindsay would be placed in the middle position which is the most painful position. When he wanted to shoot Lindsay, suddenly the electricity in the house went out so Hyder went to turn on the electricity. The opportunity was used by Lindsay to immediately escape and did not forget she brought Jenny who was in a state of fainting. 
At first she managed to get Jenny out of the house, but suddenly... The next day, Hyder was ready to perform surgery on all three of them. He puts Katsuro in front, Lindsay in the middle and Jenny in the back. Hyder pulled out Lindsay and Jenny's entire teeth and removed the lips of both women. Then he cut the skin of Katsuro and Lindsay's U-shaped buttocks so that later it could be sewn from the jaw to Lindsay and Jenny's cheeks. Hyder cut off the knee ligaments of his three victims so they could not stand up, allowing them to continue crawling. The next day, Hyder was seen relaxing and he also had time to replace the broken glass. And finally he awakened the creatures of his creation. Katsuro, Lindsay and Jenny have been transformed into human centipede. Their knees and injuries are still bandaged to speed recovery. Hyder picked up a mirror to show the change in their present form. Hyder cried tears at the success of his experiment. The next day, they were treated so inhumanely, they were locked up in a cage and invited to play like pets. And when they ate, Hyder gave dog food to Katsuro. Katsuro who does not accept being treated like a pet tries to put up a fight by biting Hyder's leg. <laughs> then, the moment Hyder was waiting for arrived. Katsuro finally got sick to her stomach and wanted to defecate. Hyder is very happy to enjoy the process of how Lindsay swallowed Katsuro's feces as well as next with Jenny who had to swallow Lindsay's feces. Once, the three of them accompanied Hyder who was swimming, but Katsuro secretly told Lindsay and Jenny to escape by crawling. Seeing those who began to obey him, it made Hyder so angry that they were tortured again. The next day, Hyder regularly checked their health. Although Katsuro and Lindsay are fine, something has happened to Jenny's digestive system that leaves her dying. Worse still, the stitch wounds in Jenny's mouth began to tear and remove pus. But at that time, Hyder's house was visited by two policemen named Kranz and Voller. They said they were searching for several people who were rumored to have disappeared, and the victims' cars were found not far from Hyder's home. Moreover, neighbors around his house often heard the screams of women coming from Hyder's house. The police investigation is currently at a dead end and the only person they suspect is Hyder. Hearing that, Hyder lied that he didn't know anything because every day he was so busy with his research that to get out of his house he didn't have time. Hyder also has a plan to anesthetize the two policemen and serve as an addition to his experiments, but here who drinks only Voller. The police who continued to urge made Hyder angry. While picking up a washcloth in the basement, Hyder warned Katsuro not to shout. Hyder also cleaned up the former spill of water but the two policemen saw Hyder who accidentally dropped an injection. The two policemen became increasingly suspicious that there was something Hyder was hiding in his house. They asked permission to check the basement, but again Hyder did not run out of mind. He did not allow the police to enter because there was no warrant and in the end the two policemen left and will return again with a warrant. When returned to the basement, Hyder was shocked when he saw they had disappeared. Katsuro managed to injure Hyder's leg. He who was fed up vented his anger by biting the skin of Hyder's neck until it came off. Katsuro then tells Lindsay and Jenny to go through the stairs so they can escape. Lindsay shows Katsuro a room in which there is a glass window. Because the glass was too thick Katsuro also used a sleeping lamp to destroy the glass. Meanwhile, the already conscious Hyder tried to chase after them on all fours. 
Using broken glass, he tries to fight Hyder but instead tells him about his family. He regrets abandoning his family to the point of being miserable, he feels he deserves to be treated like this. Finally Katsuro decided to commit suicide using the broken glass. On the other side the two policemen who had previously returned, and secretly they began to search Hyder's house. Hyder who realized the policeman's arrival to his home then crawled towards the pool to hide. Unfortunately, the anesthetic that Voller had previously taken began to react leaving him dizzy and unfocused. Kranz is shocked when he discovers Katsuro Lindsay and Jenny who have turned into human centipede. But suddenly he heard gunshots, Kranz then approached the origin of the sound and saw Voller was dead. At that very moment, Kranz was hit by a shot from Hyder, but in the last remaining life Kranz managed to shoot Hyder right in the head so that Hyder was killed. Now, Katsuro's death automatically leaves Lindsay and Jenny unable to move anywhere. Jenny who was dying, died as well. Lindsay can only moan when she gets caught between Katsuro and Jenny's bodies. Make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications, so you can watch more video like this. Thanks for watching this video until the end and see you in the next video.